Hey, welcome back. This is Nick and Noah from Beer and Bat Reps, and we have a fun rivalry match. Solid, yeah. yeah. Might actually use some like specific stratagem. We'll see. <laughs> I brought my crazy iron warriors who now have two Lord of Skulls. So, yeah. Three super heavies, because I also brought a Forge World Spartan full of 25 models that get to ride in it. Right. Um, it's a wild list. It kind of reminds me of 8th edition where you had three super heavies and then a little, yeah, just little some, bit of models some bodies. around them. Yeah. <laughs> it is fun and they actually get to benefit from Iron Warrior strats, which is cool. Yeah, there's, there's some good ones. ones in there for vehicles. So it's actually my favorite Chaos Space Marine list, probably. I mean, I know we love all the Berserkers, but yeah. I like the guns. Yeah. Guns are fun. <laughs> <laughs> and oh boy, we got... Yeah. The yeah. Imperial Fist, and it's a balanced yeah. one. It's a pretty solid list. I mean, we're running lots of heavy stuff for vehicles, you know. Yeah. Plus one damage is gross. And then a lot of DACA, because that's kind of our army's fluff. And mm -hmm. I think since the points changes, the Inceptors are very tempting with the Assault Bolters at 40 points each. Yeah. Like, they're real good now. And if you're Imperial Fist, you get Exploded Sixes. And ignores cover. And ignores and cover. <laughs> and a strat that can make you... Exploding sixes give you two extra hits instead of one extra hit. You can really spray the DACA, and he's perfectly balanced it with the heavy Hellblasters that do flat four damage against vehicles in turn <laughs> one. It looks like he list tailored, but we actually bring so many elite armies, it's smart to bring the heavy right. Hellblasters. And I figure at the end of the day, half the army, almost half, is a, against, you know, good anti tank, anti elite, and all like. What twelve inceptors should clear chaff mm -hmm. pretty easily? And so. the aggressors. Yeah, and there's some aggressors. There's plenty of DACA. Yeah, it's, it's like half and half really, because mm -hmm. he's actually trying out the heavy intercessor rifles too, so the damage two rifles. So, yeah, so damage three. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, against oh. vehicles. Yeah, because good old man, Imperial Fist. People sleep on them. Yeah, they're yeah. they're one of the worst Marines, which is still <laughs> good. Still Marines, yeah. Still good. Uh, we're doing scor Scorched Earth. You've well, seen it here before. Yeah. We roll randomly, so. It's a good one. And, you know, we are using the new uh, secondaries, but mm -hmm. if you haven't heard, all the missions are the same. Yeah. I was kind of was kind of disappointed, but also they're good missions. Like, they're balanced. Yeah. They're fair. Uh, there's not any I hate playing. Uh, and I, it would have been cool if they maybe added a few more, like yeah. two. There's um, a lot of people out there who didn't get to play at all during the pandemic. True. So it makes sense to let them continue trying these missions. <laughs> Those of us who've played them a million times are ready for new ones, but you know, it is what it is. We do have some new, we're trying out some new secondaries. I took No Prisoners, which is the new basically anti-custodes, anti-marine. Yeah, it's for every 10 wounds you take off the board, you get a point. Yep. And vehicles basically. and monsters don't count anymore, oh. but I don't have any of yeah, my lists. it's perfect so. for those elite marine armies you see at every tournament. Which, Add up all the points, divide them by 10, that's how many points you get. I'm hoping I get around 10. You know? Yeah, if you can get 10 off the secondary, you're doing well. I took Engage, it's the same. I took Banners, it's the same. So no Prisoners yeah. is my new one. Yep, uh, and I went with Titan Hunter. It changed a little. It uh, got harder to do, but you brought three Titans. So it's still so. 15 points. <laughs> so kill all I'm hoping I can kill two and get the nine. <laughs> yep. That would make me happy. Um, then Line Breaker, which is also new, because I have a lot that deep strikes in. So yeah. you can score two, I think, if you're within six inches of the enemy deployment zone, and you score four if you have a two units two wholly within. Yeah. So Made since, it a little easier. Since you're aggressive, mm -hmm. I figured I should at least be able to score, again, 10 or so off that. And then I took the mission-specific one, because I'm already going to be in his deployment zone, which is I basically have to control an objective in his deployment zone, at the start of my movement phase, do an action with an infantry unit, and then at the end of my turn, it gets removed. Burn them. And I either get like six or 12, or it might be the full like seven or 15, I'm not sure. Either it's, way. It's terrifying. Considering I'm also raising banners on those, I really right. need to defend them, so it's gonna be like this little mini game of holding mine or he takes mine. Right, how aggressive do you be? <laughs> yeah, and if you've ever seen our, our purple Imperial Fist, they're the Falcons of Terra, that's yeah. their background. Um, and eventually, we will have 18 fully painted Inceptors and nine fully painted Suppressors, all the that's Primaris fair. Jump packs. They're just fun. They're fun. Fluffy. Fluffy. It's decent. Actually, it'd probably be really good against Drakari with all those auto cannons. Yeah. <laughs> and then. And plus one damage against vehicles. Yeah. Actually, really good. You got the uh, the cool Ow. captain with the jump pack drops down with them to give them all this buff auras. So yeah. it's pretty nice. Right now, there's only 12, and we have 
Bryce 3D printing more of our cool smoke bases for right. it. So but they'll be on the table soon. Yeah. Not for, for now, the 12. Yeah. For now, 12, which is still probably better because then Pro you get to balance it with the hell last Probably so. enough. But anyway, we'll uh, go over deployment, get to the roll off and Excited. all that. So thanks for tuning in. Cheers, guys. As we start over here with the Falcons of Terra, what do we got, Noah? We have the aggressors, obviously, with their Bolt Storm gauntlets. Then uh, one five pack of intercessors. Uh, all the Intercessor Sergeants have Grenade Launcher and Power Sword, because some extra points. Then the first 10 pack of Hell Blasters, there's no, no cover left for them, so yeah, sit on the objective. Then in here, there's another 10 pack of Hell Blasters dispersed. Right in front of them is, uh, I think that's the Combat Squatted uh, Intercessors. Right. Because it was to 10 pack and two 5 packs. And then uh, the Lieutenant and the Chaplain. All chaplain primaries. is yeah the wise order all that good stuff then here is another five pack of intercessors and then there's another five pack over here and over our <coughs> lots of line of sight bloggers so yeah hopefully <laughs> everyone that asked for that no they're just five but yep. then off the board we have two combat squatted full units of inceptors and the warlord himself the jump back. back so we got a lot it's a beta strike we got yeah a lot coming turn two and he has the uh eye of hypnoth so he's basically a lieutenant and a captain Oof. he has the hand of dorn for the extra three cps because you should always pay for that relic and actually give him storm of fire because i think maybe not against your this specific army but against marines that extra ap is great yeah ap3 when they come down yeah on sixes, sixes to wounds yeah so it's just fishing for sixes is fun. Yeah. And they do it on the hit and the wound. Right. Of that. It's just fun. It's good. Like, so you can see the objectives. Midfield. Another six. Up by him. Another one by him. Domination. Another midfield. A good secondary now. Yeah, it's but you'd have to... It's hold three, hold more. Not yeah. hold most. Okay. So you uh, have to not just hold terrible. three. It's, it got better, but it's still bad. One in front of there <laughs> and one under him. And we'll take a look at the Iron Warriors. See how they stack up. And we have this very elite, very big and scary Iron Warriors army. We have a Spartan. If you don't know what a Spartan is, it holds 25 models. It has eight LAS cannons. And I paid the points for a multi-melter as well. So this thing puts out 10 high strength anti-tank shots, uh, which should do all right against two wound models. Just don't roll ones on the D6. All right. <laughs> Uh, inside the Spartan, <laughs> two units of 10 cultists and a five pack of Havocs with LAS cannons. So it is packed to the gills. Next to that, we have a sorcerer, and the sorcerer has the the main two, the best two spells, prescience and warp time. Next to him, ready for warp time, is mm -hmm. our brand new, beautiful Lord of Skulls. I just love that smooth airbrush paint scheme. Thank you, whoever sold it to me on eBay. <laughs> <laughs> and then the one I painted that doesn't look quite as good, but still another Lord of Skulls. And then we have our evil Celestine Jump Pack Chaos Lord with Lightning Claws and the Rapacious Talons, which basically makes them damage to Lightning Claws with really good AP. A super Blender. Yep. Um, and then the Warlord trait is the Siege Master, which makes all Havocs or Iron Warriors vehicles, which they are now that because I have all three, uh, reroll hits of one and wounds of one went by him. So we both kind of have the guy that does both. Yeah, we're basically yeah, opposite chapters. Hiding over here, we have 10 cultists. Hiding in this tree, we have a single chaos spawn. And I forgot to say it, way over here, hiding under this tree, we have another single chaos spawn. You know, 23 points for an annoying model. I like it. Um, this is a big roll off. We've got a lot of good line of sight blocker, but this gap right here is a little scary. And it's kind of fact that we both bring a lot of Guns. Guns. That, <laughs> a lot that of work guns. really well. Big roll off. Two to one. We got Iron Fail. Warriors first. All right, we'll come back out to their movement phase. Okay, so a little bit of rumbling forward. We let out two of our three units from the Spartan to grab objectives. I planted banners on both these objectives with the cultist. Um, some spawn jumped on these as well just to help hold them. I did prescience onto the Spartan. So with its 10 powerful shots, it's now hitting on BS2+. Plus. And then I did warp time to this guy and failed. Yeah, womp womp. He would have been about right here. So right? no flamer for him. No, but. this guy jumped up to this one, so I'm actually on four objectives right now. Oh yeah, so I got pretty good. lucky with a failed warp time. Yeah, it's a good start. We were talking off camera, 
as much as people complain about Chaos Space Marines, they have some of the best stratagems, spells, and synergy. Yep. I mean, just everything works with each other. So, a so, little bit, of, well, a little bit of shooting. A lot of shooting, a lot of shooting. Uh, we'll start with the Havocs. Um, I'm gonna spend two CP. Of uh, no, they don't need plus one to wound because they're straight nothing. Yeah. So uh, we'll start by going, they can't see these in the open. So we'll have to shoot through the trees into the woods. I'll take it. Are you pop in any kind of transhuman? It's a 10 pack, right? No, I won't. Okay. So, uh, I don't know, I have two packs. Actually, no, I won't. <laughs> oh, saving them for the ones in the open. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so going through the woods. So we hit on fours now. These are the last cannons. They really didn't matter at all. That's right. Score. Uh, two's the wound. Hey, should have used two. Two minus three. So sixes. Oh. Okay. First one, five Dies. wounds. Second one, five wounds. Yep, two die. Laz cannons. Can you Laz? Pup, okay. Pup. Actually, no. Yes. But. Not, not bad for the Havocs. We'll take it. Um, next, we're going to go to the big boat itself. Nice. And, uh, hmm. We're gonna put, we're gonna do eight Laz Cannon here. Oh no, sorry, into the Hell Blasters that I've already picked on. Gotcha. We're gonna do uh, the two multi melters here, just to see what you nice. think you're gonna pop them. So are you doing Transhuman? We'll do it on these guys. The ones I've already picked on? Yep, okay. so it's two down to 10. So here's the Laz Cannon hitting on it would be twos, but I'm going through the woods. So threes. Hey, one less shot and <laughs> fours. Fours, though, yep. Should have used it last time. There we go. Well, I only, think I rolled fives or something. Only say, no, you rolled two threes. Oh, did I? Oh, yeah. I should have done it. All right, so fours. Four last cannons. Oh! Not even making armor saves. Oh, no. <laughs> First one, dead. Second one, just barely. Third one, you're home for a one. Nope. It's a four get. At least smoked. that wasn't against a vehicle. Yeah. Jeez. Uh, oh, and the heavy boulders into them too. Sorry, I forgot how many guns this freaking thing has. Doesn't um, he replace this heavy bolter? No, it's an addition. You can, oh, get a, you can get an extra heavy bolter, so you have nine shots. Right. Because he's got the twin and the mounts it on top. Right, yeah. right, right. I don't have the model yet. I'm going to get it. <laughs> mm -hmm. So here's the multi melters. Woohoo! And they hit on twos! Yeah. Oh, there you go. That helps you. Heavy bolters. Okay. And threes. There oh. it is. Four. We should probably stop one. using the black dice. Minus one. Yeah, three go down. Yeah, two damage each. <sighs> Alpha strike. Okay. Yeah. All that's all that he can reach is with his Gatling, which is twelve shots. And uh, you know, naturally, I'm going to go into the ones without transhuman. Yeah. And I'm going to spend one CP to reroll hits and wounds because he's a demon engine. Because it's ridiculous. Um, so, three's to hit. Woohoo! One yeah. whole miss. <laughs> three's to wound. There, there's the reroll paying off. Oh, goodness. The best strat in the game. Yep. Uh, 11 at minus two flat two. Well, this'll hurt. Yep. I rolled real well, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven die. Holy cow. Woo! Well, sorry about the Alpha Strike goes at home. Um, he's got a lot coming still. I guess I could have put him out of line of sight, but. Yeah, you knew it had to move with the heavy, so it's tricky. And we move on to here. For Hitting the on fours is better than being dead. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. Uh, then we go to here and we'll split it. We'll do Gatling here and Flamer there. Nice. So here's the Flamer, four hits. Cause I was scared of that tree. <laughs> right. uh, it is strength 10. So twos, and these are at minus three flat three. Sixes, Four. save two. Wow. Yeah, the, the bolters. The bolters <laughs> made their saves. Mm, oh, great. Man. All right, so then uh, 12 from the Gatling into these guys. And I'm rerolling ones to hit and win because the Warlord right here. Cool. Yep, it's Full very, house. very dangerous. Full house. Got some twos. There you go. They reroll uh, no ones, right? Oh, yeah. All right. And they're minus two. So cover. four up saves. One, two, three, four. Woo! 
And that's the end of my turn. Yeah. Strong, strong turn. Yeah, I'd say so. You cleared about 400 and some points. I think they're better than knights. Much. They're 500 points. They're also as many, yeah, they're, they're, they're 100 500 points. points. <laughs> so we will see if I can bounce back. Yeah, I gotta hit it hard. Okay, after a very strong alpha strike, it's time to hit back a little bit. We have these guys coming out from cover, aggressors, ready to shoot and charge the big tank. He was pointing out that both his uh, litanies got off. So plus one to hit and wound, and this is the closest. So he could just do flat four damage with no save of any kind if he targets this. Right. Cause it's minus five in Heavy Doctrine. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, and then over here, they just grab that, getting ready to get charged by Big Boy. Um, yeah, he needs to hit back fairly hard this turn. He does have a lot off the board for turn two, but he's gotta wait till turn two. <laughs> right, so this is it. What do you got, man? A lot of stra strats getting used or? Not yet, I don't think, because these guys hit on twos, wound on twos, re-rolling already. So I don't need a plus one to wound with them. So we forgot that they had a six appeal no pain strat that he popped after he shot, and he killed seven of them. So when he rolled all those dice, two came back to life, one with one left. We're pretty friendly around here. Uh, we, we, if we forget something very important, we remind each other. So. Yes. He's got two left. He had to spend three total CP yeah, to keep them alive. It's a big investment. Yeah, so but now we're back to his shooting phase. Still. And, but at flat four damage, that could be a potential eight more wounds on something. Yeah, it, it might be worth it. We will see. Anyway, um, da, 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 other da. strats. You could do ex super explosions with these guys, but they're at AP nothing right now. They are. I mean, I could spend a lot of CP and get them to an AP and blah, yeah. blah, blah. blah. Can they see through to kill the cultists? No. Um, doesn't look like it. You know what? I will spend two. I think we're the we're in a desperate position. So I'll yep. spend two to put them in every single doctrine. The aggressors? Yeah, because <laughs> if they make their charge, they'll be AP four. Those power whatever. fists. Yeah, he really wants to bring down the Spartan. It's mean. It kills oh, whole units. Get so many points. Yeah. there's dudes in there. <laughs> yeah, there are. There's ten more and they're ready to get banners. Um, so two for that. Then we'll spend two more to give them plus one to wound. Okay. You can do plus one to wound? Yeah, it's against a vehicle. Against vehicles. Gross! Yeah. So now they'll be wounded on fives. Yeah, Instead still not going to do much of anything. Yeah. <laughs> give but, it the last well, actually, wounds. I don't have to spin that yet until I actually target him. In exactly. case somehow all the Hellblasters do their thing. Yeah, you never know. And here, here we go. Okay, stratagems start, are done. Start with the little two? No, we're going to start with the big pack. So a four <laughs> over here. Yeah, that's my big pack now. <laughs> four left. Uh, so we're gonna overcharge because it's all going in the Spartan. Right? All of it. Yeah. So yeah. they get all their chaplain buffs. Okay. So the sergeant twos hit. And the other guys. Oh, uh, one burns. You could reroll it. It's not a bad use of it. Yeah, we'll see. Peter reroll. Hey, oh, devil on his shoulder. My favorite thing <laughs> about this game, like. <laughs> all right, now just twos. Re twos rerolling ones. Awesome. You dropped it. <laughs> sure. There you go. So that's like, 12 shh. damage. That was two reroll ones on camera. <laughs> that yeah. were ones. Yeah. So one and... So he's down to eight. He took 12 real quick. And he took 12. Three. We'll see if we can kill him with these guys. We're yeah. overcharging. Yep. So three's to hit. <laughs> one wound left. Hit. Um. Other guy. Hit. hit. And then threes, because they didn't have the plus on the wood. They don't get plus one. One. Another four damage. Down to four. Ouch. Uh, the aggressor I love that flat four. Okay, he rolled really good. These are all minus one, and he's trying to get these last four. So three up saves. One, two, three, four. Now it would be very stupid of me not to reroll one of these, so I'm going to. So I'm down to four. Well, Noah. Yeah, pull a nick <laughs> most of the time. Yeah, hey, you passed it. it. Good, you're letting me charge. Yep. That's all you're doing. One wound remaining on the Spartan. I mean, it's very crippled at this point, but... I mean, we're still going to try and we shoot got some Dacus, and then the damage two guns. Yeah, That's won't matter. It's better AP, though. Uh, so it's just five shots. Better AP right now. Devastator yeah. Doctrine. Oh, yeah. They're, They're like minus three. three or something. I like it. And this will be the grenade, because I did give them all grenade launchers. Okay. Da, 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 da. Awesome. You got One it. hit. Any kind of rerolls? Nope. Oh, no. He, and he exploded. Guy, so. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Uh, one, one wound at minus... Because there's still just strength four. Yeah. Okay. Minus three. I think. We'll look it up. Because it the normal one's minus one. Is it only minus one? The heavy? No, I meant the normal, like, rapid oh. fire one. 
So then this was probably minus two, and then it's Devastator Doctrine, which makes it minus three. Yeah. And I rolled a one. That's so it. It doesn't matter. A bolter killed him. Watch this massive explosion. Nope. Without, that'll be cool. Uh, I got ten guys in here. So maybe uh, like I get one two will die. Nicer. One will die. That'd be cool. Ten little cultists and two die. Aha. We'll get those out off camera, but you know, a ragged cheer goes up from the Falcons. Yeah. Soften me up a little bit before the backup comes in next turn. Yep. So here's the eight cultists that piled out. We wanted to make sure we weren't close enough for the aggressors to charge. He also, with those guys, shot way across the field and killed three cultists. Pretty good shots. Not horrible. You killed the Spartan. That's 500 points. I probably killed 500 points. Very close to it. It's so 400 and some. Even though it felt like a crippling alpha strike, we each killed 500 points. Yeah, so but we'll see how this next, next turn goes. You I'm got. Gonna not going to have any anti-vehicle weapons left after yeah. next turn. You got, yeah, the, the Lord of Skulls are going to do some work. Uh, we'll come back with turn two of Iron Warriors. Here uh, we go. Yeah, so I planted, or I scored on these banners. These guys moved up here, these cultists, and planted a banner there. Just kind of force your hand. In the sh psychic phase, he failed it, prescient, and then failed at warp time i re-rolled it with a cp and he rolled two sixes so he hurt himself but warp time went off that's why he's right yeah in he's face right in my face sixes. probably gonna crush those poor little dudes <laughs> over here he moved his 10 inches up the warlord and jump pack followed him and a spawn is on this objective but that kind of leaves just like just a handful of cultists on each objective yeah so in terms of clearing objectives the game it won't be too hard i moved the spawn deeper into this corner to keep him from deep striking over here so, so I didn't want that. And he's out in the open just ready to get slayed. <laughs> he did that his happens. job though. Yeah. I yeah, probably exactly. won't even shoot at him. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna go with this guy first. And we're gonna go uh, Flamer here. Yeah. And uh, the uh, Gatling into the Cell Blasters. They'll use Transhuman. For, for all the one CP now. Yeah. So here's the Gatling. I'm not rerolling anything. I'm, not, I'm gonna save my CP because I'm down to four. Uh, but still, oh, minus one. There we go. The woods helped you a little bit. Yeah, one last hit. <laughs> and then fours. Oh, transhuman. Yeah, save only the day. three at minus two. And you pop the plus one save for the rest of the game as long as right. they don't move. They're and not it, moving. And it's then a bolster defenses. Yep. I think is what it's called. Fist strategy. So four ups. Yeah, because minus two. Well, uh, made me save a dude. So two die. Sergeant's still there. Ready to do flat three damage next turn. <laughs> All, right. All right, flame ran of these guys. Four hits. Ouch. And that's strength 10. So twos. Hey. Oh, here we go. Minus three. Made one. Two they dead. Both die. Flat <laughs> three damage. Okay. Wow. Now we just go over there. Mm. Same deal. Although I don't want to kill them because I need to charge so them. So you don't shoot them. Period. Exactly. That is correct. So I'm going 12 Gatling shots into the guys that are into no. yeah, the five pack. That makes the most sense. I mean, you could kill that last Hell Blaster, but uh, he's not obsec. Yeah. So. We'll go up to them. Hey, minus one. Wow. We're rolling Save, one. Saving me from the... one hit. Yep. You've been rolling quite well, yes. friend. I love my Iron Warriors. All right. And then uh, twos. That's strength eight. Yeah. Strength eight. We're rolling ones. There we go. Awesome. Full house. Yep. Minus two. Dead, 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 dead. All dead. Oh, that tree's glued? No way. Whatever. They're all dead. <laughs> that that five that. pack is gone. We'll pull them in a second. We know uh, they're dead. That's the end of my shooting phase because I don't even want to waste time shooting cultists strength three. Oh, no. I got these hell blasters. Or er, havocs. So the havocs back here. Uh, they're dead. The character? <laughs> yeah. So the four of these will go into the. Uh, one without an imbol. Yeah, the lieutenant. He's yep. gonna die. So lieutenant, threes to hit. Oh, shooting through the woods, fours to hit, but cool. still got a full house. <laughs> Twos, there we go. Four minus three. Made two. Oh, crap. All right, two ups, or wounds, yeah. seven wounds. All right, got him. Uh, now we go to charge phase. Yeah. Is that Overwatch. Ooh. This is a freaking disaster of a game here. Yeah. Charging into there, charging here. You made it. Five. And we'll roll some dice. All right, I'm popping the strat that only works against Imperial Fists and his real hits and wounds. In combat. In combat. What do so you know? He's got five attacks with his axe. 
he hits on threes, but I I literally hit some ones. Good thing I did it. Yeah. One miss. E and, and then twos. Uh, twos strength okay. twenty. Yeah. Hey, um, reroll. It doesn't matter. They're already dead. And that's minus four, flat six. Yeah. So three of them get swiped. Crunch. And he'll just a little punch into the man. Uh, All right. Over there. Guess we'll what? I'm not jumping in. <laughs> but I am going to use transhuman. Ooh. All right. So we've got 12 attacks plus one for if, if that's the way it works. Uh, I don't know. Would you multiply afterwards? Whatever. It's, it's a little ridiculous. You are using transhuman, though? Yeah. Okay. So we got some misses. This is still at base strength, which is 10. Fours. Oh, oh didn't matter. this is minus two flat three. Well, I tried, guys. Yeah. <laughs> when I'm rolling like this, it's a little crazy. Dead. I made or it not down. flat three, D3. Doesn't matter. I'm still dead. Oh, I made, I made the force one. Failed. Yeah, the force failed. <laughs> so, yeah, they're all dead. And I'll just stay with that. And that's a ridiculous first two turns. Um, Alrighty. Wow. Okay. Falcons in, coming in. We'll see. Okay, so way over in this corner. We got a three pack landing in the woods. Whew. Ready to kind of help clear this little soft side of the board. Gotta be annoying somewhere. I was just perfect with my units to where he could not land anywhere. So anywhere I want. Way to. back here, he's created a new castle. Um, <laughs> ready to shoot everything at him and hope he doesn't come wrecking all the way across the board here with war time. So we will yeah. see how this goes. Where are we starting? Go big or go home. We'll start with the pack of. Uh, yeah, guys, Receptors. off camera, right before we started the game, after we had already done our uh, intro, he decided a full, well, leaving one a full six pack is good for all yeah. the buffs. I don't have enough for the double buffs. buff, but yep. I, I wanted ex super exploding sixes and plus one to wound, but plus one to wound is just better. Yeah. So unfortunately, they had come down after the chaplain right. recited <laughs> litanies, but. So they are so now. He has plus one to hit. Yep, he's got plus one to hit from the litany. You have a guy with I have Hypnoth ready to give reroll ones to hit and wound everybody. Yep. So that's really nice. So we could do some damage here. So yep. let's we'll have to see. Start it off with a bang. The chaplain will throw a crack grenade. <laughs> nice. Everything has to go right here. Hits. There it is. That's what we needed though. Wound. T8. Oh, uh, I saw the no. five. Okay. Tried. Uh, we'll overcharge this guy because he's a hero. Hits on two. Just one shot. Oh, yeah. God. Hit. Okay, hits not a plus one, but overcharge. So threes, wounds, minus, minus four, yeah. five up in bull. Cool. Saved it. Bram, 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 bram. Cool. Great, that's gonna uh, be three damage. These guys with their super buff will go. go. So 36. We'll come back. Yep. Wow, he rolled really good with the exploding uh, sixes and fours to wound because of his Imperial Fist strat against a vehicle. So these guys are just really good. I almost feel like if you're anyone but Imperial Fist, you run the dual plasma. They went but if you're, way up. But if you're Imperial Fist, you run these. Dude, the plasmas now, I think, are 50 points a model, where these are Jeez. 40. Well, and so. because they come down turn two, they're an extra AP. So this gets me all the way to my invul. I spent one CP because he is Iron Warriors for a six up, feel no pain. So we'll so see how this five goes. Five up, six up. Oh, I rolled great. Jeez. The dice are with me today. Yes. Yeah, that, that is stupid. You rolled over half or about half five yeah. ups. So oh, no, no sixes. Okay. Instead, I rolled four sixes. Great. What in the world? Okay. Well, I thought I did well. Five, eight wounds. He's down to 20. Yeah, he starts with 28. He's a beast. Uh, six of feel no pain for one CP. Great. Yeah, it should be tiered. Like, oh, if you have 16 or more wounds, it's <laughs> 2 CP. Oh, the benefits of a very old codex. Right, that's gonna stay old. They've like been re-releasing every codex and chaos hasn't even been touched. <laughs> like, they're like, yeah. here, we'll give you 2.0 so we can... You know why? They're waiting for like Fulgrim and Ingram. They're yeah. gonna bring out... Uh, Next pack, yep. we'll go. Not nearly as buffed up, but still. Hey, it'll show up here. All right, reroll ones. His rerolls are One, too. two, three, sixes, which mm, is all my misses. Cool. Full house, there you go. But now five, five rerolling ones. Not horrible. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Pretty good, actually. Eight, five ups. There we go. A more normal roll. And now six ups. 
Good. Three, six. Great. <laughs> so three more wounds. You made seven feel no pain yep. already. Yep, and a ton of five up. Yep. Jeez. Now um, the damage two guys. Yep. They did move, those. so they're hitting on fours, plus the grenade launcher, which but you're is all ones. Yeah. And that hits on threes. And that's a bolt bolt weapon, so that's right. one extra. Nice. But then fives and sixes. Rolling ones. Uh, nothing. Wow. Nothing. Uh, he'll shoot with his, uh, he has a combi flamer, so he'll shoot go. with both. Uh, the bolter profile. <laughs> Needed threes to hit, because I was shooting <laughs> with both. And the flamer gets two hits. Sixes. Nothing. Okay. All right. You did 11 wounds. Not uh, terrible, but you should have done a lot more. I just rolled insane. Yeah. I don't even think I want to charge you, because whoever I charge you with, He's going to get squished. I mean, you'll just overwatch them and kill them. Oh, yeah. Overwatch is pretty gross, too. Yeah. Oh, Flat over... three damage flamer? <laughs> That's pretty gross. We swing over here. 18 yeah. shots. How are you splitting this I'm thing? just going to go with the cultist. Yeah, I've got to clear him. There we go. Straight through it. And since you're in the terrain, you're not getting the minus one. All right. Let's kill him. Forest. Oh, whiff. No six. This is why I shot everything at him. I don't even think I have enough hits to kill him. But it's threes to kill them. Oh no. Three died. Three dead. That was, that was garbage. Uh, we'll, go. well, not only did you have great turns, <laughs> I had bad yeah, turns. It's one of those games, guys. Uh, so we got, we I guess you could try to charge him. Sure. Nine inch. I'm in dense, it's 11 inch. All right. Oh, <laughs> failed it either way. <laughs> All right, we'll see if they pass morale. On um, a two, they do. Easily, yeah. They're yeah. they're probably leadership five or six, but they passed. <laughs> yeah. Um. Wow. Yikes, guys. Thanks for sticking with us. If you stuck with us this far, yeah. it's Iron Warriors turn three for all those Chaos fans coming up. Okay, this is a turn three recap. Because it was bad. Yep. They <laughs> shot... Well, first I did a, I tried to do a warp time and I killed myself with another yeah. perils, which is hilarious. That psyker was not on point this time. <laughs> Everyone's kind of on an objective. We're all over the place. He failed his charge because he had to go through the woods. So I think even with the 12, he oh, Between reach. their shooting, they cleared Everything. all nine inceptors and five intercessors. And yep. somehow he lived through combat. I yeah. got lucky. I only wounded once, I whiffed, and then he rolled a four up for his invul. But still. And we okay, go to turn three, zero and this is how turn. the turn looks. I scored another 15 along with tons of secondaries. So we'll probably have just little recaps from here on out to see how this game winds up. So, between charging and shooting, they cleared these cultists and the spawn off that. So, cleared two objectives. Good job over here. Over here, we're going straight to combat, and the warlord with the relic blade and jump pack has popped the bitter enemy strat. Same one I have. Yeah. That is reroll hits and wounds in combat. So, here we go. Relic blade. Good thing. All Five hits, but strength seven. Fives rerolling. Oh, Not good horrible. Start. Good start. Good finish. Three of them. Minus. Three. Yep, gets me to my end bowl. Hey, fail, fail, fail. Six damage. Nice. Which just makes you better. In down combat. to 11. <laughs> well, I go down in strength, but up in attacks. It's funny. Right, but you already like, you started strength, what, eight, ten? And now I would swing first. You swing before. Him. Yeah. So we're going to throw. Uh, I started 28, so I'm definitely bracketed. So now I'm up to six attacks. Yeah, you're not bracketed twice. Yeah. Close. Um, and we'll throw it at Yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, so it fails. Hey, here we go. This is what happened last time, too, this time. Now we gotta pass them both. Flat six damage. Oh, oh down he goes. He gets crumped. Slice. Okay, well. Oh, and also this single shot put three damage on my Chaos Lord way over there. Right. Because that's fun. And then you go and kill everything. Turn four, yeah. He's gonna whip around and kill them. We'll get all the secondaries. You ready to concede? Oh, you we'll called this. Last right. turn it was over. It yeah. Was just we had to do some fun stuff. I do we'll, like that your psyker exploded. That yeah, was good. that was hilarious. We'll talk out the points and come back with the final score. Whoa. Uh, sorry about the one sided battle, guys. Um, before you complain about line of sight, we got tons of it. Huge, Huge L's. As much as we own. Yeah. <laughs> other than the giant building, which we'll add to the next one. But, sure. <laughs> uh, Tons of line of sight. It's just that my things that shoot can move sideways 10 inches before they shoot. And so they're all good range. Kind of, yeah. Or move twice. Yeah. Move or 20 move twice. inches and shoot. It's yeah. like, yeah. 
Uh, and he was kind of, he had one issue with deployment where it's like, do I hide him behind line of sight and then move and shoot on my turn with minus one to hit, or I put him yeah. right in the open and hope transhuman helps. I got greedy. If yeah. I had gone first, I think I would have easily flattened a Lord of Skulls. Oh, yeah. Like, no. The Spartan for sure. The Spartan would have died. Yeah. The Lord, I was going to go for a Lord of Skulls just because they're better. <laughs> totally. But yeah, going second, rough. Yeah. All my, you had enough board control too with mm -hmm. all your little units to basically shut me down. I didn't pick the best secondaries, but I don't think there were any great ones. Yeah. I mean, so I raised the banners, turn two, you're there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Like, oh, I Man. get zero points, yay. When you have an army where the half of your strength hits turn two, and then you lose the roll off, you gotta suffer two shooting phases before they can come down. Yeah. It's just, turn one is still too strong. Oh, it's still too strong. And deep strike is not that good. Um, I don't know if you've heard the rumors about uh, well, it's not rumors, they told us, but uh, third edition AOS, the person who goes second gets more CPs. Yeah, they get an extra command so point. that's kind of cool. They could do something like that just to help out. It used to yeah. be, hey, my whole army's in cover for two CPs. If that was amazing. I don't know, was that like too good? I think they thought it was too good because a lot of people were choosing to go second. Well, what you could do is bring that rule back, but keep the roll off to where you don't get to choose. Yeah, I think two CPs is pretty like cool heavy tax for that too. Yeah. Especially if you play something that ignores cover. Well, now that we <laughs> start with more CP, you can even make it three CP. People right. still do it. If you want to tax them, yeah, do it. Yeah. Do I it, mean, GW. My Iron Warriors ignore cover. Yeah, so the we Imperial don't care. Fist ignore cover. <laughs> we don't care, but still, it'd be very good. Uh, final score ended up being 92 to 28. Yeah, smash. It That's was a like, smash. like two turns of me not on the board. Yeah. But yeah. Um, <laughs> but I mean, honestly, this is our in-house tournament. So like, yeah. This is how a lot of tournament games do look, unfortunately. Yeah, it's 28 the, usually score more than that. That's true. It'd still be like 92 to 60. Yeah, if, like, if it's a strong list, you're gonna score 90 plus if you're winning. Very strong list. Yeah, and you want to. But. And this is a very strong list to be honest. Like, people hate on super heavies, but I think these little skulls, they actually work at night. They're gonna get hit really hard if you don't go first. You gotta kill the hard targets that are gonna kill you. So it's a dice roll to go first. They're also still beefy though. I mean, yeah, 28 beefy. wounds, T8, two up, say, or three up, five up, like. That's, Six up, feel no pain for one Right, CP. That's not bad. Yeah. Not bad at all. They can still get warp time. Mm -hmm. um, Prescience is pretty decent. That one CP to reroll hits and wounds is just ridiculous. Well, yeah, that's. Like, Imperial silly. Knights wish they had that. Like, that's crazy. Yeah, they should. Um, <laughs> but. You know, the cultists did their job, the spawn did their job. The spawn are surprisingly good. Actually. Last cannons killed two important marines a turn. Not terrible. Yeah. They clearly got their um, points back. Like yeah. those those were like thirty three point marines. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I mean I could even see dropping the Spartan and just bringing a full three units of the last cannon havocs. Yeah. I Instead mean, of a third we were talking about getting a third Lord of Skulls to make it an actual right. like, Well then they wouldn't get Iron Warriors though, stuff. Well, a third one, they'd just be one detachment of super heavies. Oh, yeah, I meant if you dropped him for more. Yes, less. exactly, yeah, I would lose that. So that's tricky. I um, keep bringing him, he's pretty, he's beefy and unique. No one understands that, like, it puts out 20 good shots. Yeah, it's Spartan, it's Spartan's like, fun. Oh, what? And a lot of times people don't shoot at him because they're scared of the Lord of Skulls, so, like, late game, he's just rolling around, sitting on an objective, shooting nine, eight las cannons at people. Yeah. Um, scary. It was a good game, though. I mean, I, yeah. it was basically one of those, you go first, you're going to do well. Yeah, if you had gone first, you would have killed probably Lord of Skulls instead of the Spartan, just because yeah. then I wouldn't be able to get in your face as fast. Right. I mean, but. if I, I killed that Spartan with, like, six Hellblasters. <laughs> it was a little crazy. So if that I had 20 damage. Hellblasters, yeah. like... Granted, I wouldn't have had the plus one to wound from the chaplain, but I would have had the plus one to wound from a stratagem. So, I mean... Yeah. I, I probably also Falcons. should have started the captain on the board. Yeah. I love the Falcons, but it's a it was a hard <laughs> matchup for them. Oh, yeah. I mean... Plus. But now we get to see Iron Warriors versus Space Wolves in the second round. Yeah. It's a wall of dreadnoughts. So we will That'll see. be very fun. Well, and Nine Outriders, too. So yeah. they have good flexibility, too, the Space Wolves. They're, they're quick, they have screening units, they have a lot of shooting and combat. A lot of powerful named characters that are like, we'll fight Lord Skulls, let's yeah. go. Well, like, I bet Bjorn would just tear one in half. Yeah, like, Murder Fang. Yeah. There's uh, eight invuls that are each flat three. Good luck. Right. <laughs> but uh, anyway. it's a crazy game. Hope you guys, you know, I hate seeing Strong Alpha Strike in a battle report. Hopefully you guys stuck with us. 
Yeah. Uh, like, subscribe, tell your friends. We'll be back with more of our in-house tournament yes. very, very soon. I think it's time, It's about time for Jakari versus Ultramarines. Yeah, I think we have two, one or two games left in the first round. Yep. Two. Yep. Admech versus Demons and Ultramarines versus Jakari. We've held off Admech versus Demons for two reasons. One, I really want to use my painted Bellacore. And Admech's new book is coming. Yeah. You ordered it, right? Yep. It's, so it's, in, it's in the mail, according uh, to GW. Yeah. <laughs> so that's how long that takes. 28 days. That's yep. the promise. Oh, there you go. <laughs> and then uh, you're pretty much there painted wise for Ultramarines, right? I want to run 30 Hellblasters, but I can run a different list. Yeah. I have 20 paint. And uh, <laughs> my Dracari list is my freaks. It's like. Yeah. Halloween colors on a bunch of just random monsters. It's fun. It's not the Jakari list that are winning tournaments. No. But it's still powerful with a nice new book. Neither is uh, my Ultramarines. I mean, it's, yeah. It's going to be a fun. It's one third, fun one third Hellblasters, like this list, but the Assault version. Because yeah. it's better. And the winner goes against Tyranids. So that's just a fun bracket. That's just going to be a fun one. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. One way or the other, thanks for watching. Yeah. Cheers, guys. Later.